guys so today i'll be speaking about the lead code problem reshaping the matrix uh, the problem states that we have a matrix of some rows and columns uh, here in this case nums and we want to convert it into a matrix of some other dimension so from 2 cross 2 it's uh, for in this example it's been converted to 1 cross 4 uh, now it's a fairly easy problem but i feel like there is one important uh, discussion that we need to make so so for this 2 cross 2 matrix say comma 1 comma 2 3 comma 4 converting this into 1 cross 4 is simple we just make a single row however we need to uh like make sure that the rows multiplied by columns in this site so okay i will use a different color for this so essentially the rows multiplied by column should be equal to the rows multiplied by column so the total number of elements should be equal in both the sides if for this let's say we were asked to convert to 2 cross 4 that is not possible simply because 2 cross 4 will need to have 8 elements in the matrix but we only are uh, restricted by 4 elements so in this case we only have this 4 elements to restrict us with so 8 elements is never possible so that's basically the whole idea so one like h case we had to consider so coming back to the code it's pretty straightforward so we are given uh, the nums and the r and c which denotes the rows and the columns i believe uh, to positive represent the row and column of the wanted reshape matrix okay these are like the um, rows and columns of the transform matrix so first of all we will take the rows so let's call it r and that will be start length we will need the column which will be the first rows length and we need to create an array out of this transform dimensions so for in this case it will be r we need to map this in order to map each row to a column so this will be c and we need an empty array so first we need to check whether the rows total number of elements in the in our nums array is equal to the total number of elements in the transform matrix if it is not then we will have to like in this case if it is not so we'll just return the original matrix we'll return the matrix and otherwise we have to take each element and pop and push them into an um, into this array uh, you know what you just we just called it matrix in this one array so i less than r i plus plus and then for each column it will be g equal to 0 j less than c plus plus and we need to push this in the uh, array so it will be nums i j 
and then delta equal to uh, r minus 1 so we will be traversing the uh, array of all the post elements in the opposite direction so that we can fill it the matrix in the reverse direction i is greater than 0 minus minus so we can basically pop elements from the array so it will be c minus 1 c greater than equal to 0 g minus minus and matrix i comma j will be array the pop and at the end we will have to return this matrix so that's basically it let's see okay accept it and submit it okay passed so that's all guys i hope you enjoyed this video and if you enjoyed this video please do give a like and don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you guys in my next video. Thanks.